Now, this isn't like my normal background setup, but I am gonna do some more videos. But I just had to post this bathing suit. I mean, it is so flattering. Like, I just, I love the colors, like how the, this is like a mesh, like a see-through mesh, super soft. And y'all, I tried, the first one I tried on was like, um, like a blue and yellow and I'll spice a picture in right here. I found a few pictures for us. I think it's so becoming and it's super sexy. So I left the mesh on because this is probably one of the tiniest bathing suits I own. And although I live in South Florida, um, I don't want to have my butt hanging out, you know? Maybe like after a year of the Peloton a couple times a week, then, then we can reevaluate. Um, but, you know, even though I'm plus size, I want to look sexy, but also look classy. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the suit. And I think I bought like five more. I bought every size. Cause this is a three XL. See if I can get the back on there. Forgive my hair if it's not combed because it's not combed. <laughs> Et voila. Oh, you know, I should take this mesh off so you can actually see how um, how amazing this mesh makes my body look. Not saying I don't have a nice body, but the mesh kind of like covers up. It's a, it's a nice cover up. Let me put it like that. Because, you know, this is kind of like right here was more hidden. And then like this area too wasn't as noticeable. This is the beginning of the channel, so y'all, you know, forgive me if it's a really super low tech, but uh, I'm gonna get better as it keeps going on because I really like posting the videos and stuff. And I mean, I love clothes, I love fashion. It's just like a hobby. So I like fashion and I love arranging flowers. Like, it's this is like my adult coloring this one is called Stock, and it's it smells so good. It makes the whole apartment smell amazing. This is eucalyptus. These are all three different kinds of hydrangea. So it's like white, this green, and a different green. It's like the same, same setup, but a different vase. And then I have these like palm leaves here just kind of give me some background if you guys see things and you're like oh i want to know what that would look like on um a size 20 i think i weigh 107 sorry i weigh 275 pounds i'm 5'8 um so like in the shein i'm a 4x and then in regular clothes, I'm like a 2x or 18 but it's weird like in shein the 4x is a 20 but in like, I feel like U.S. clothes sizes, the 2X is like an 18. So it's a little bit different size. They have free shipping both ways. And then um, they have some really cool coupons on there. Go up to the 169 and take the 20% off. Then you could have um, the maximum discount on your entire order. Um, I was looking at my receipts and it looks like I'm spending about $300 each time. But now I think I'm going to get the cart because I'll go on there and just have a running cart. Like I'm looking through, I'm looking through like right now I have, um, I have one dress in the cart, but it's not enough. It, you know, it doesn't make sense to order just one dress from there because you really maximize your discount uh, if you're purchasing in vol volume. So um, I saw that. And I'm also in the Shein Club. Shein. She, is it Shein? Shein? I've been saying Shein. Um, I know it's a little bit controversial, and I didn't realize that until after I'd already embarked upon this journey because um, I actually had this sign made and did this whole decoration wall just exactly for this channel, not for anything else. Um, because it's like, if I'm doing something, even though it's not, like, let's say it's a hobby, but I mean, I want to kind of have fun, right? 
it, it's a fun hobby. Um, and I get so many questions about, you know, my clothes all over town. It just makes like, everywhere I am. I'm like, oh, girl, leave that dress when you leaving. <laughs> People want to get this green dress. I have that green dress with that really pretty print on it and the one slit. Every time I wear it, someone gives me a compliment. So, um, that's it. If you have any questions for me, anything I can answer, you know, drop it in the comments. Um, I'm not going to put a timeline. I'm, I have a super busy work life, so I'm not going to do like, I'm going to put a video out every week. No. That, that would just set us up for failure. I'm going to do them when I feel like it, when my energy is, is ready to do it. And then I'm going to try to put them out as soon as I get the clothes because then they're not sold out. A lot of the videos I put up, some of those things are already sold out. But I bought that stuff like six months ago. Some of it six months ago, some of it three months ago. Um, and it seems like they get a ton of new clothes but if you see something that's sold out i did see on there you can um submit an inquiry for it and i bet you if they get enough inquiries they'll just produce another run of it so um i'm excited to be doing this i have so much fun doing it i love doing the videos i pick the little music tracks um so I hope y'all have a wonderful day. I am going to get back to my actual job. And then, but I had this bathing suit on. I was sitting outside and I was like, man, I got to take a video of this for them. So this was my last order, March 19th. And you can click here and look at order details. And you see with that Shein club, it's a couple dollars off each dress, but y'all, is um every penny counts i really look at money like every single cent i have to protect that because if i give respect to money then money will stay around me if i don't respect small amounts of money how will i be able to manage large amounts of money um so i really try to look at everything like that that's just personally you know me obviously so this is that um if y'all are watch all the videos remember i said i got that dress that was a 4X, so this is the one I got in a 3X. So I'm gonna go through and um, look at all these two. So my total was 212, and then I had a $40 discount. $10 discount with the Shein Club. So it ended up being 172. I'm really excited about it. I mean, their clothes are really pretty. That's just so chic. Okay, so that's order number one. Let's look at the second order. Let's look at what I got here. Oh yeah, that leather dress. You know, I really don't wear stuff like that without a bra because my boobs are so, you know, in need of control at all times and underwire. But I wanted to try it. Oh, yeah, I ordered a ton of bathing suits. Look at this one. It's something about the color orange this year that it, I'm gravitating towards it. I think in my early, like, when I was in college, I would wear a lot of grays. And then I got out of my gray phase and I went to, like, the pinks, like the pastel pink. And then I just am coming out of this heavily green phase. Um... And now I think the new color might be orange. That is just stunning. So I'm excited about what some of these are going to look like. Look at this one too. So when I'm looking at clothes on here, I try to go with the fabrics that look really soft and really smooth that already currently look that way. Not like I'm um, picking things that don't look like they'll, they'll feel good. All right, let's see. I made an order January 25th. All right, so we have this order, which ended up being $140 after saving $40 on it. So if you think about it, $40 is really the equivalent to like two or three dresses. 
And y'all, if you want, um, I know I'm kind of going through kind of fast, just pause the video. And then you can zoom in and see the order number and um, see what and I bought. And then if y'all want to see something more specific, just uh, send me a little message or put a comment like, hey, can you try this on and drop me a link and I can buy it and try it on. I'm thinking about also um, doing these videos for Hanifa and Eloquy and Torrid and... Those are really the main people that I buy my clothes from. Um, I get clothes from Macy's and Saks, but after discovering Shein, it's like, why am I spending um, $200 on a dress that I could have had 10 dresses? And I understand the the moral, cultural implications, but y'all, I'm recording this on an iPhone. Um, this phone was also built with child labor. And if you have any appliances in your home, then a lot of those are also built with child labor. So do we stop using everything in our lives because of child labor when we live in a society that is no longer just thinking about your home country? It's more of a global economy. Uh, where standards are not the same all the way, you know, everywhere else that like it is here. So I don't, I don't know how to feel about it. I was going here um, to show you like the coupons on Shein because they have different levels. And I'm, like I said, I'm also in the Shein club and I think that's already paid for itself um, many times over because you, it's just such a huge discount on clothes that are already starting off really cheap. So even just for the one dress, they're willing to give you free shipping and 10% off. It's free shipping, free returns. Uh, every time I've had to return something, it was never a problem. So if you look on here, you see that 20% off for orders over 169. That really has saved so much money for me using this website. And it keeps me coming back. I can't, you know, it's, it's hard to beat one of the most beautiful dresses I have, and it was only $8. So maybe people are speaking out against Shein because they are cutting out the middleman and it's more direct fashion marketing to you. Because a lot of these other companies, you have to buy these types of beautiful dresses and, you know, in quantity to get them. So they have really opened up a lot, a lot of fashion especially to, to me, to the plus size world. So I don't know how to feel about it. I do enjoy their website. I love their clothes. Are all of them great? No, but a lot of them are.